This tutorial will demonstrate how to search for clinical practice guidelines. According to the Institute of Medicine, clinical practice guidelines are statements that include recommendations intended to optimize patient care that are informed by a systematic review of evidence and an assessment of the benefits and harms of alternative care options. Clinical practice guidelines can be, find in, can be found in databases such as Ovid Medline and the TRIP database, as well as through specific organizations and institutes like the American College of Physicians. We are going to use Ovid Medline for the first part of this tutorial. To start, click the Ovid link on the library homepage, library.tulsa.ou.edu. Click the Ovid Medline link at the top of the list. At this point, you may be prompted to log in using your OUHSC credentials. We will search for clinical practice guidelines to answer the following clinical question. In adults with major depressive disorder, are alternative medicine treatments more effective than pharmacologic treatment? Before we begin to search, we first need to adjust our question to fit the PICO format. The PICO format helps define questions to address specific clinical issues and aids in finding relevant evidence in the literature. Using the PICO format, we'll choose the following keywords to structure our search. Population, major depression, intervention, alternative medicine, comparison, pharmacologic treatment, and outcome, remission or reduction in depressive symptoms. To start, we will match our search terms to medical subject headings used in this database. Make sure the map term to subject heading box is checked. Enter the phrase major depression and click enter or hit the search button. This screen allows you to choose the MeSH term that best describes your subject. Check the box next to Depressive Disorder Major. Check Explode to include any narrower terms under Depressive Disorder Major as well. Then click Continue to search for results with this subject heading. On this page, you will see a number of subheadings that apply to the subject heading you chose. Since we're just beginning this search and want to keep our options as broad as possible, let's click the Continue button to complete the search. This effectively includes all subheadings. You now return to the main search screen, but this time with a list of results for the subject heading Depressive Disorder Major. We can now continue by searching for the second ter search term from our clinical question. This time, we'll search for alternative medicine. Enter alternative medicine in the search box and press the Enter key. Leave the box checked for complementary therapies and proceed as we did for the major depressive disorder search, making sure to check the Explode option and include all subheadings. We now have two separate sets of search results. To combine these two search results, select the check marks next to each search in the Search History section. Then select the AND button next to the label Continue With. The two sets of results are now combined. The results in this set each have Depressive Disorder Major and Complementary Therapies as subject headings. We still need to limit the results to clinical practice guidelines. To do this, Select the Additional Limits button underneath the search bar. At the top, you'll first see a section detailing your search history. The last search you performed, which should be labeled 1 and 2, will have the radio button next to it checked. Below your search history, you will see a large number of limits that you can choose from. In the Limits section, look for the Publication Type section in the right column. There are many publication types available, including meta-analysis, systematic reviews, randomized controlled trials, and more. You can select multiple publication types by using the Control or Command key. For now, let's select the Practice Guideline option. Then click the Limit a Search button. Now that we've learned how to search for clinical practice guidelines in Ovid Medline, let's look at a few other ways to search for this type of document. Some other library databases allow users to limit results to clinical practice guidelines. 
try applying the practice guidelines limit to your searches in PubMed, CINAHL, and Embase. The TRIP, or Turning Research into Practice database, also allows users to easily filter results for clinical practice guidelines. The Schusterman Library does not subscribe to the TRIP database, but it is available via a freemium business model. Searching for clinical practice guidelines is a free feature. To access the TRIP database, go to tripdatabase.com. We are now at the TRIP database. Unlike Ovid Medline, TRIP is not organized by subject headings. Therefore, we will type in a keyword search. Type major depression and alternative medicine or complementary therapies into the search bar and hit enter. You should now see a batch of search results on the left side of the screen. The right side of the screen displays the available filters. Under the Guidelines section, select USA to filter by guidelines from the United States. The results should now include the practice guideline we examined in Ovid Medline, as well as many others. In addition to searching databases, Clinical practice guidelines can also be found by going directly to the organizations that produce guidelines. A few of these organizations include the National Institutes of Health, the American College of Physicians, and the U.S. Department of Veterans Affairs Clinical Practice Guidelines. To learn how to search for other types of publications, check out more of the library's evidence-based practice tutorials. Happy searching!